You see the little shit going. That's a video. What's up, fight fans? This is Kurt DeVille with Counter Punch Boxing News, and I have some new news concerning Tyson, the Gypsy King Fury. Tyson Fury, out of the blue, all of a sudden, changed hotel rooms. And normally, we've heard of people changing hotel rooms before, like Lomachenko changed hotel rooms to stay away from Teofimo and his entourage and things of that nature, you know, and... We know this fight is somewhat racially charged, right? Definitely on uh, one side, you know, of the spectrum, you know, and um, the question you ask yourself, why? Why would Tyson Fury just up and change security? Now, we know Tyson is like a weird or strange fellow. So he might have done that just on the premise of just, hey, being paranoid and saying, you know what? Let's change. Let's do. Let's go here. Let's leave. And he could have done that. But then again, maybe he had a reason to do that. You know, um, since this fight is somewhat racially charged because a lot of people, you know, that's backing Wilder believes that Tyson Fury cheating him, cheated him. And a lot of people are unstable. You know, when you come to making threats against Tyson Fury's trainer and Tyson Fury himself and doing those type of things or wishing bad things would happen to this particular person, and then you're following a person that also wishes the same thing, bad things that happen to this particular person. Well, you know, that may be a reason why Tyson Fury just up and left and changed hotels. You know, and I think the, the best thing to do would be up the security. Because this is the thing. This is what I want to ask you guys. What happens if Tyson Fury repeats what he did in the second in the second fight? I don't think that'll necessarily happen right away. But let's say that happened. What would you think the response would be, especially since this boxing match has changed into something else besides a boxing match? Because see, a lot of things are symbolism to other things. Like this could be symbolism to people that race bait, people that hate race or different races. It could be a lot of different things for that reason. And you don't want anyone uh, unstable that feels like, oh, well, Tyson Fury only won because of this or pick a reason, you know, to cer certain things to transpire. You know, I think changing hotel rooms is a red flag. You know, it could just be precautionary, which would be great. But then what if somebody threatened them and they just don't want to come forth? Well, you have to understand what threats mean. Threaten threats can mean anything. It can mean nothing but anything, but they mean something. Someone is telling them what they want to do to one another, you know, based on a fight. Okay. So, uh, I think at the end of the day, I feel that, um, Tyson fear, if he wins, he needs, he, he needs more security because you don't never know what could happen and how someone could respond to Tyson Fury once again, winning the fight. Okay. So, you know, him changing hotel rooms could just be, you know, the beginning, you know, we'll, you know, who, who only knows what'll happen uh, if Tyson Fury wins. But anyway, you guys tell me what you think of Tyson Fury moving secure, moving hotel rooms out of the blue. Of course, please subscribe. And you guys been counterpunch. Peace.